It's about time. What's going on? Yo. Yo. Rumor Report. Rumor Report. This is the Rumor Report. Talk to him. With Angela Yee on The Breakfast Club. Well, congratulations to Little Kim. She's getting the 2019 I Am Hip Hop Award at the BET Hip Hop Awards. Okay. Mm-hmm. Very deserving. Now she y'all know hip-hop. she does have an album coming out. It's called Nine. They haven't given us a relief date yet, but she's been putting out songs. And she just put out a new single. It's called Found You featuring OT Genesis and City Girls. More new music for y'all today. All right, Lil' Kim. All right. So congratulations to Little Kim for getting her I Am Hip Hop Award. Well deserved. Yep. Now, Eddie Murphy has expressed some remorse. He talked to the New York Times and, you know, he's doing his comeback. He's going to be doing his first comedy special for Netflix since he did Raw back in 1987. Think about it. That's over 30 years ago. He said uh, he was dealing with a heartbreak at the time that he did Raw. And he said that he does cringe at his old material. He said, I was a young guy processing a broken heart, you know, kind of an a-hole. And he also says that he remembers being picketed due to the homophobic material in his specials. He now says that is ignorant. And he says there's no anxiety, though, about returning to the stage in 2019. He said, I now have a whole lifetime of experiences to draw upon. There was a time when I was at the center of everything, what I was doing and how funny I was and how popular. I'm not at the center. Now my kids are and everything revolves around them. He has eight kids. Didn't I tell y'all this was going to happen? Eddie Murphy is very smart because he's getting ahead of it because he knows this generation is so stupid that they would absolutely dig up his old material as soon as he starts putting out new movies and doing SNL and trying to paint him as something that he hasn't, that he's clearly not anymore. It was well, 30 years ago. It's not too hard to dig like, up Jesus raw Christ. or delirious or any of his old things, but yes, yeah, so he's going to be doing his new stand-up. As if people don't grow and people don't evolve, you're going to hold Eddie Murphy accountable for something he said 30 years ago on a comedy stage? Or maybe he really does feel like at that, now he's, that he's no, bad, he's I'm smart sure he does because he knows like that they're going to come for him, so he you might as well it. get ahead of it. I told y'all this already. I told y'all this two weeks ago. All right, now Soldier Boy has gained 50 pounds since he cut out lean and alcohol. So what is he, what, like 155 now? Uh, All right. Soldier gonna want your fade when he see you next he was time. At 100, he was 130 pounds at the beginning of his sentence, and he has since gained 50 pounds. Okay, so he's so, 180-ish. You know what? He's saving money, too, because he was uh, using so many drugs and lean that mm-hmm. he was spending between $500 to $800 a day on lean alone. So since then, he's also stayed off of social media, if you guys have noticed. He hasn't tweeted or put anything on Instagram since coming home from jail. That's good. It seems like he's healing. Yeah, three months, and there you go. All right, I'm Angela Yee, and that is your Rumor Report. All right, thank you, Miss Yee. Shalabay! Yes, sir. What are you giving that donkey to? Hey, four after the hour, let's talk some good old-fashioned racism. Oh, Why boy. don't we? Oh, we need Heather Pratt to come to the front of the congregation. We like to have a word with her. Oh. We like to have a word with her. All right. All right. All right. Well, she we- might infuriate a few niggers out there, but we're going to get through it. We're going to heal together. Now, how many niggers can we say back-to-back? I'm just curious. That's it. That's it. <laughs> but it's, hold on now. No, no, y- no. Y'all told me it was two per break. Two. So that was two. Okay, so next break. Next, next break. So I'll ration out my ni- <laughs> so I'll ration out my N-words next break. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Dog of the day's next is The Breakfast Club. Good morning.